A disabled Mill Creek man claims his wheelchair was stolen over the weekend. Eleanor LaQuatra has more about his emotional plea to the person who may have taken it. Richard Lombardo faces severe health issues that have taken a toll on his body. Bad blood circulation in his legs causes Lombardo to fall frequently, which has led to dislocated discs in his back. I'm in a chair because I got bad legs and a bad back. I get emotional because I feel bad about it. I'm young. But he was in the process of rehabilitation, walking more, losing weight, until Sunday. Lombardo says he rode his motorized wheelchair to look at cars at Champion Ford on West 26th Street. His caretaker, Melissa, walking by his side. The battery on his wheelchair died. I had to put it in neutral, and we pushed it over behind the bank by a key bank, and uh, we put it by, by the bushes there. They called a cab to Richard's house to get the charger. When they returned, the motorized wheelchair, valued at $5,000, was gone. Lombardo filed a police report in hopes of finding the chair, but in the meantime, he's basically immobile, stuck at home, and feels he's a major burden on those who help him. Now that we don't have the wheelchair, I have to, I have to push him in his walker, and it's... It was, it was ridiculously hard. Lombardo says his insurance company will replace the missing wheelchair, but the process could take months. He's now making an emotional plea to the public. I don't care who you are or what you did, as long as the chair is not destroyed or nothing, just drop it off and leave it, and I, I don't care. I just want my chair back. That's all I care about. Elena LaQuatra, Jet 24, Action News.